he's taking Elaine on his roller coaster of death. I've got to reach her before she becomes his undead bride. What's happened to me? Head foggy. Can't think. I'm swimming. Must concentrate and rescue Elaine. I've got to save Elaine. But how can I save Elaine when I'm just a little boy? Oh, if only I could think straight. Must clear my mind. <laughs> Welcome to the Big Whoop Carnival, little guy. Come on over here and meet your old pal, Dingy Dog. Oh, for crying out loud. How can I win one of these fabulous prizes? Well, that's easy, <laughs> matey. If I can't guess your weight or your age, you get to pick what you want. What's the catch? <laughs> There's no catch. It's just that easy. I'll bet you can't guess how old I am. <laughs> bet you I can. A little fearsome buccaneer like yourself must be seven years old. Ha! Wrong. I just so happen to be 20. <laughs> well, do you have any proof for your old pal Dingy Dog? You calling me a liar? <laughs> you bet I am. <laughs> I have my proof right here. Scum Actors Guild membership card. Guybrush Threepwood, age 20? I suppose you're right. <laughs> Pick your prize. Give me that anchor. Well, take it away, son. Congratulations. <laughs> Enjoy your stay here at Big Wolf. Look into your heart. It's Murray. What? You picked the anchor? It's a really nice anchor, Murray. Sorry. Now it's a heavy pie pan. Now I've got a heavy pie pan full of shaving cream. I can't believe you picked that stupid anchor instead of me. What are you doing over there? I found this pie, mister. Huh? Oh, yeah, thanks, kid. Shoot it, shoot it. Not right now. Oh, but I want to see the cannon fire. Beat cheeks, half pint. Look, man, I pay your salary. You want me to tell the check you've got on happy kids running around here? Okay, okay, you little... <laughs> Did you just hear something? No. Weird. Maybe it's the acoustics of that smelly giant head. Shut up, kid. What good is a dumb hunk of iron anyway? It's not even a real anchor. I'm a real talking skull. Yoo-hoo, stinky Mr. Rat. Hey, get out of there, you little punk. What are you gonna do about it, vermin boy? This'll teach you. After all we've been through together. Fine, take the stupid anchor. <laughs> now that's not very nice, little boy. Come on, now stop hitting your pal, Dingy Dog. You would have made a lousy undead monster anyway. I'm not gonna warn you again, kid. <laughs> you better cut that out. I'm going to wait for an owner who understands my need to bring fear and pestilence on the likes of you. You're really starting to bug me, kid. Get out of here. All right. <laughs> that does it. You're going down, little punk. Ow, he bit me. Hey, give me back that hair, kid. You're ruining the suit. If you value your life, mere mortal, you will flee before Murray, scourge of the living, and uber skull of the underworld. What kind of snow cones do you have? <laughs> what kind of cones did you ask? Why, I have every kind imaginable. I have the most distinct type of snow cones in the world. In fact, my cones are so original, so inventive, and so <laughs> unique that most are completely inedible. 
let me list some for you. I have sweet cones, meat cones, cold cones, mold cones, bold cones with lime, cones with slime, <laughs> veggie cones, wedgie cones, hedgy cones. I used some of my neighbor's edge in that one. Cones with spice, cones with lice, berry cones, hairy cones, dairy cones, and the Christmas, oh, 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 merry cone. So, what do you think of that? Hmm. I'd like a plain snow cone, please. Okay, kid. <laughs> Bye now. Mmm, <laughs> peppery goodness. Ooh, uh, hairy. That meringue looks tasty. Ooh. Ooh. The pepper helps, though. Uh, yeah. ah, brain freeze. <laughs>